What's going on everybody? So this is a quick one. Uh, got a project that I'm doing that I've not done before, nor have I seen anybody else doing. So we're gonna take a look at it. So hang on tight. So I had a customer call me and kind of like in a panic saying, hey, I need to get this done. Uh, it's gotta be done by Tuesday and this is what it is. So they are wanting to engrave a like a quote uh, for a someone that is in the Air Force and is getting restationed. And they want it engraved on a football helmet visor. I've, I've never done this before, you know, curved surface. It's also made out of a polycarbonate. So like different, like, okay, is it CO2? Is it fiber? What is it? And did a little bit of research this morning. I'm like, you know what? Let's try it on the fiber. Let's see what happens. So I did a, a couple of tests on some acrylic and just like normal acrylic and it worked. So it came out, hang on a second, let's find it. Where'd that, where'd that sample go? All right, so here is my sample with the fiber laser on black acrylic. So it works like, and, and it's pretty quick and it looks good. So I was happy with it, um, but now it, we got another monster. So we're talking about a curved surface and it's semi-transparent. So we'll take a look at this. So here's my setup. I, I put some, some corn in here or some popcorn so that way I could kind of keep it heavy. I've set it up, kind of centered it because it's hard to see the, uh, the red light through the polycarbonate. So I went here and just tried to kind of put it best I could. Um, and I also leveled it. So I kind of set my level here and leveled that out the best I could compared to the table. So now I did a test and it's underneath one of these corners and it worked. So now I'm just working up the courage to hit the, the go button and see if this works. Uh, the way I set this up, I actually focused it to the top and then I dropped it just a little bit because I'm trying to compensate for that, that curved surface. So I, I think it's time to just hit the button. If I screw it up, I screw it up. We'll, we'll see. All right, here goes nothing. Let's just give her hell. Okay, so that's one one pass, one you know cross hatch. So I think I'm gonna have to do a couple more. So I'm gonna shut the video off and then run a couple more passes. I gotta focus on this a little bit more and then I'll show you the final result. All right, I had to do some tinkering, but this is what it looks like. So it looks pretty dang good, but here's what I had to do. I mean, you could see in the video, this area got done pretty well. And then none of the text here and none of the text here was showing up. So in Lightburn, I ended up uh, turning the text all into paths. So that way I could select, say like the left side. Sorry, you're getting some glare from the window there. Um, but yeah, so I could go and just select, say, hey, I want everything that's right here and run that at a different focus. And then get everything over here and run that at a different focus. So as I was going and getting farther and farther to the sides, I was actually turning the focus down like just a couple millimeters at a time. And I've even gone and like picked letters and run them again just to get them a little bit more um, stand out just a little bit better. But all in all, for never doing this before and it being kind of an odd shape, different material I've never touched, I think it turned out pretty dang good. Now, lessons learned. Here we are in the real, real world where stuff gets messed up. I did it upside down. This is how the visor goes in. And I, I don't know, I, I guess I saw the holes, thought that it attached to the top part of the helmet. I don't know, I don't know. But looks good, gonna order another one. It's gonna be here tomorrow on Amazon. Thank you, Amazon. Um, and run it again, get it done for the customer get it sent out. So 
if this video was helpful, if it was interesting to you, if it also gave you a real look into what it is like running a laser business and that stuff gets messed up, like this video, follow the page, subscribe, hit the bell, all of those things, and we will see you on the next one.